what I'm saying? This is what happens. I'm gonna get in here early in the morning, me and my main man. Dig it, you know what I'm yep, saying? Yep. It's Rev. time, baby. It's a rev life. <laughs> That's what it is. Rev life this morning, man. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. We got games at 8 o'clock. 739. It's 739. <laughs> we here 20 minutes early, like real refs. Real supposed real. to be. You gotta get there early. You on the dig what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Cause you know, if you ain't here early, you're gonna be running in. You ain't gonna be able to get no coffee. Nothing. You ain't gonna be able to warm up. You just gonna have to go ahead on in there and get it started. Hey, look, there you go, look. It's all it's going down today. Early this morning. Hey, hey, hey. We already had it this morning, refs. We here early, man. When you're a good ref, you come early, man, because you got to warm your body up. Wait a minute, this dude done brought the, we, we, we doing basketball today. He done brought the football rule book. He got, oh, he got, oh, he got the chair. When you got to take the chair? Well, you got to take it. Nigga, take it before the season starts. Before the first. Yeah, before the first. I got to get on. When you're official, you just have a bunch of different sports that you handle, man. You're good at it. Got to get that test in your life. <laughs> we ain't early, man. We need some coffee. We really need some coffee. Oh, yeah. That's what we need. So we got court. We on court six. Down two. We on court six today. We got the, we got the A grade squad. This is the A grade squad? Yes, sir. This is the A grade squad. We got coach on here. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? This is the ref life. We're going down. 8 o'clock a.m. You no, know, it's rough. I ain't had no coffee this morning. I need some coffee. Yeah, we got the youngsters on the other court. Everybody gonna be on there. Then we got... Yeah, the real fly early. Hey. And we got T-Bone over at T-Bone. ain't ready. We ready. What happens in the morning when you ready? Yeah, don't be talking to us there this morning. We're trying to get started. We're going to be all right, though. This is what I'm tell you about Travis. This is what happened early in the morning, man. Early in the morning. Referees. This is what we do, man. What it say? Respect the call, man. Don't talk to me about no call. All my calls is all right. All right. Every call. Holly the dog. You know I had to come holly my people. You know I got to holly. Spike Lee. Spike Lee. Spike Lee. Yeah, man. It's a Jay Horn joint, man. You know what it is. Jay Horn film. Big Jesus over here. You know what it is. You know what I'm saying? It's my man right here. He know. He know. We all been here. We all been here, baby. That's right. Good. Oh, my God. Everybody else get ready, we get ready too. See what I'm saying? Arms up, you know. A lot of running and play. We do a lot of stuff. Get ready. Okay, maybe four turns around here. We've been, we've been on the road a lot. Yeah. Good luck, man. I gotta get my people to eat, buddy. What's up, baby? Oh, it's the ref life. The ref life going on the documentary. Man, get a piece of something, man. Get him from here. Let's get the cheese. Let's get the cheese. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, my man, cheese. Yeah, yeah. What's up, man? What's up? Tell him what's up. Hey, this dude right here, after every time he sit out, he's going to go get him something to eat. This guy right here. Go get him something to eat. Hey, Tommy. Hey, hey, this guy right here, he gonna stop. This guy right here got his second lunch with him, wait, he don't have to leave his seat. Right here, this guy right here. Hey, 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 hey
And it felt like a little hateration. I said, you smell it? I smell it. It's bullshit. It's like you got to eat in your in the Stuff in the This guy here got everything in his bag. This guy can't get hurt. I got my chicken. I got everything. I got my gay rainbow. I got everything I need, baby. This is what this is real rap life right here. This is not regular rap life. You hear me? Yeah, this is real. I want money to live, baby. The big money is in your pocket. You know? That's what we want to see. Show it to me. I don't know. I'm out here trying to get it like you, baby. You know what I'm saying? Man, what's going on, everybody? What's up? Good morning. Good morning. Get me going. We already ready this morning. Good morning, too. Tell them something good this morning, man. What did that tell the people something? I'm tired. I'm tired, boss. Another long weekend getting started. Making sure that we get all the fish's perspective. So this is what happens when the game is tight, when the coach starts complaining, right? But we gotta push. Right, what's up, baby? This is OG Reverie right here. And so now we got the director Tom is getting some complaints from a coach. So he had to come over and babysit the coach because he feel like the officials are not calling for a game. So let's hear what let's hear what they have to say. He came with and he didn't give him that was a play That was a play He pushed him and he hit his head. So they just had a referee conference in the middle to talk about it. This is a rev light. So Tom has to come over and babysit coaches and sometimes when incidents happen and he has to be the fireman. He had to put out the fire. This is what happens when you're the administrator. I know Tom get tired of it, don't you, Tom? I don't like babysitting. <laughs> I don't have problems, nor do I have diapers. But he like the babysitting. Gotta get some grub. This is the ref life. Respect the call. That's what my shirt say. Respect the call. But you gotta respect the call. You paid for it. You had enough money. Get a breath of burrito and some coffee. Then I get some change. Look at that. So we been ready to finish this up. This burrito is pretty good. The only thing about it, you just gotta keep putting sauce on it like that. But it's good though. I can't lie, I don't you know I'm not a sauce person. We, we just finished up our little bite to eat. All right. And now we back rolling. Get some more footage. But the rev life is going down. I don't know how many we got today. Eight. Two damn minutes. We got two minutes today. Eight. We got an eight piece today. 
Eight is enough. Get rid of your hair. What you trying to say? Yeah. You you trying I'm to trying ball? to say you lose your hair when you rep. <laughs> Every year you lose a couple more strands in rep life. I've been repping 20 something years. Yeah, 20 something years. I only got 15 in, so I, I got a couple pieces of hair left. Yeah, let's see. I'm losing a little it. Little spot yeah, right there. I come right there. My tips is getting weak. Uh, uh, look, this is rep life. Tips, tips, tips getting weak. What's up, 
Man, what's up with the doggy? Got a documentary going. You know, I got the Real Life documentary going on. That's what's up, man. Hey, hey are you, are you, are you, oh, yeah, we got the team now. Oh, we got the team. Now. Right. What's racist? What's team? This team right here? They said the iron. We got what happened? That means the ref is racist. That constitutes racist. You know what? Racist. Being racist people. Well, to see, the problem is the team was equally divided. There was four white girls and four black girls. He was racist. He was racist against the half of the team, but not the other half. That's right. to the other coach because he crying. Well, there's two number 10s out there. Well. Right. Then we got, you got fans. Fans coming over there getting all, all up in our business. Like, we already handled it. But we got to explain that because y'all want to get jerseys with the same number. Spend your money for the organization. And how did the dog? Getting ready for Vegas? Yeah, we're gonna win Vegas. So, moving out of Vegas. We're gonna win Vegas. Y'all heard it. The man said they're gonna win Vegas. Y'all gonna be in Vegas? You ain't going to Vegas? No. no. My next old team won. Next year? Okay, alright, man. We're gonna see what you're gonna do. You know, I'm gonna be watching. Next weekend, where y'all at? Next weekend, I don't know where we are. We probably uh, gonna be up. Until, yeah. until Vegas. Nah, he's uh, 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 so y'all play every weekend to Vegas. Y'all might be in Grapevine next weekend. Probably. Well, I'll be out there. They probably 
Tuesday, y'all Frisco? Huh? That what you said, Tuesday? We playing Frisco. On the 20? Yeah, I'm gonna see you later. All right. Well, that's a tough reality in rep life. Racism against the women. Women should be able to officiate just like men. I agree with these women officials that it was kind of sexist to change their schedule. And we got some good women officials. It's not like they some scrubs. And hold on, let me okay. just say this. Go ahead and say it. If he changed the rest, and then he still, it was two male reps, and he ditched the whole game about their call and said that he didn't like them. He didn't want them to come back because he didn't like them. But you made a woman move who might have to give you better call. You know, you know what I'm saying? He so still wasn't it happy. It wasn't about it. He still wasn't happy. So it's just, it just makes it what he, that just makes his decision to say he didn't want a woman rep even dumber because he was still mad about calls. You know what I'm saying? Right. Everyone's a rep. We all make calls. It doesn't matter if you're a woman or a man. You make good calls, you make bad calls. You know what I mean? Texas discrimination. Wow. She got to schedule to work. He comes and changes it because he don't like women. Last <laughs> time I told him not to say another word. He left you alone. Are you going to be all right? He left you alone. You don't need to go out there on your head. No, I'm not. This is what you need out to cover game. Right. Because your throat is dry. Don't dry. Can they rotate? Can they rotate? Can they rotate? Yeah. Oh, yeah, rotate that code, man. Look at the big man down there. You think he want to rotate? You think he want to rotate? You think he want to rotate? What's going on in the game? Man, what's going on is they playing a bunch of football. Hey, yo, what's up, man? Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> is this really gonna be on YouTube? Yeah. Dr. Will. Respect the game. Brother Mundine. Respect the game, Jim. And then who else needs to be on the doggy? Hey, we just matching around here. We got a break. They trying to say we not refereeing around here, but that's not the truth. Yeah. Respect the referees, and we are calling games now. We're blowing the whistle. Yeah. Respect the game. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, the dog. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Brother Mike Don, give us respect the game. To right. Respect the game. All right. I can say is respect the game. Right. Huh? Okay. <laughs> Y'all ain't got no game right now. It's been a hey, it's been a long weekend. Don't hate the players. It's been a long weekend. Don't hate the referees. Hate the game, y'all. Yeah, dog. Right. <laughs> Put the work in. Right. At the end of the day, you're looking for that dog, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That bone, you got to get it, right? That's what we have to you do. Get that bone. Don't hate the refs. Hate the game. Yeah. Y'all. Look how tough that was, buddy. Real tough. What was the coach talking about? A bunch of nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> A whole bunch of nothing. Yeah, did you get paid last night? Huh? Uh -huh. What happened? Right. Did you get paid last night? He said, what happened? Yeah. Every time I get paid, I'm going towards something. Hey, hey. 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 Every time I get paid, my wife take every dollar. Uh -huh. <laughs> Coach, uh, he wants me to call Breach. Contact. That's right. But if your player is moving, trying to avoid the contact, and their hands is up, your players initiate the contact. So there's no problems going to be made. So I don't understand why they think that they know what's going on more than the real. We get paid to come out here on the court. Matter of fact, this dude ought to say, oh, you must got a new camera. He a hater. We get paid to come out here and do this every day. That's why the shirts say, respect the cop. Right? You gotta respect it. That's what they put us out there to do. Manage the game, and it's a wrap. So how did the dog? It's a rev life. No cow, people. Right here. Stay right here, baby. 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 Right here, baby.
take corners. <laughs> and when things get real bad, we bring in two babysitters, <laughs> the dual team. <laughs> Get your life together. What did you say to you, What happened? He's just running his mouth, man. What did he say to you? He said, when he lost the ball and I reach around, he want that to be a reach I said, he ain't reaching. He hit the ball from behind. Y'all been calling him the other reach. I said, that's not a reach. Just click the button, it's free. You'll get the notification when the next Rev Life Series is on. I appreciate you watching, because I worked really hard to get all this together. We'll see the next Rev in the next tournament on the next weekend. How did you die? So today is the last day of the tournament, Championship Sunday. Everybody winding down. It's almost over. Got two games left by the eight. Feet is a little sore, but my day is almost done. I'm getting ready to head home to my family. And enjoy. I'm going to get ready for the work week. This is the ref life. We try to make sure that uh, the parents, coaches, and the players understand the rules and understand the reasons why we call certain violations. So I'm going to try to do my best to give everybody watching a tip on certain calls that referees make that sometimes the parents, players, and coaches just don't understand. All right? Parent tip number one. I, oh, excuse me. Parent tip number one. Over the back is not a call. Every time I go out and officiate different gyms, different places, fans, coaches, and sometimes players are screaming, over the back, over the back. Okay, over the back is not a call. It's nowhere in the violations. It's nowhere in the rule books. The correct call for a play of that sort is push. That's the correct call, push. And there are a few reasons why, a few scenarios why an official would call a push in the back. First scenario. If the defensive player has boxed out when a shot goes up and the offensive player jumps through the defender that's boxing out and displaces them, that is a violation. An official, a good official in position would call a push. Okay? If the defensive player does not box out and the offensive player after a shot goes up, just out jumps that person and they're back to back, that is a no call. There's no violation there. Nobody gained advantage. So just because a guy jumps at the same time another guy jumps and they're in the same vicinity and there's marginal contact, that does not constitute a call being made by an official. That's my parent tip of the day. This is the ref life.